Hello, my name is Esther Agada from Lagos, Nigeria, and this is my American Academy of Dramatic Arts position. Thank you. Um, I can confidently say that acting is what I'm good at. Acting is what I really love to do. I have passion for. I I started acting when I was in high school, where I joined the drama group, and I had my first stage play, which was titled Another World, and I played a role of a local maiden, and it was awesome. Like I really, really fell in love with my performance, and I decided ever since then I decided that this is what I want to pursue with my life. And this is the career I want to settle for. And the American Academy of Dramatic Arts has a good quality, good faculty, and a good updated skills and tools that will help me get to where I'm going in life. Thank you. However it goes, it makes it go that way. It reminds me of Eric. That man walked out on me and that was the best thing that could ever happen to me. When he left, I tell myself, if you have to say hello before you can say goodbye, I'm not going to worry about nobody saying goodbye to me no more. I can't go through another one of their goodbyes again. He was standing upstairs in the hallway. When he left, he told me he's leaving. And I asked, why? What's for? After 12 years, after you done used me up, you want to leave? He said he got something to do. And he went on and gathered up his stuffs. He left a razor and a pair of shoes. They are still up there. When he got to the doorway, I told him, leave your piece to please. Don't leave me here by myself. He didn't say anything. And he brought out his pistol and he handed it over to me. And I said to him, I will shoot you. And we both laughed about it. And he kissed me goodbye. So what I'm trying to say is, do not let no man use you up and tell you he wants to leave. Shoot him first. I have never believed in destiny. No. The stars never whispered my name, my future. I grabbed my own fate with two hungry hands, pulling and pushing and molding my life, leaving smudges and dirty fingers all over a clean also. My mistakes entirely belongs to me. No, the stars never mapped out a path for me to follow, never planned my downfall, my triumph. I rule the stars, not the other way around. I take their dust and inject it in my vein. I breathe in their light as a leaf. 